Hi there, welcome back to the channel. I am Jayashree, an artist and illustrator based in India. And in this video, I am going to tell you 5 things to keep in mind while you are working in layers with gouache. So when you are working with gouache, you mostly work in layers in order to achieve details in your paintings. So the first thing to keep in mind while painting with gouache is that the consistency of your paints should be thick and if you add too much water to the paints, it will lose its opacity and when you are painting in layers, you need the paints to be opaque. The second thing to keep in mind is that the dark colors dry a little lighter and the light colors dry a little darker. So when we paint a dark color, it dries a little bit lighter as you can see here and with gouache you can work from light to dark and dark to light as well. I will explain this during this process. As you can see I am working with darker paints on a lighter background and we can work as efficiently in the opposite direction as well. Another thing to keep in mind is that before painting the next element or the next layer, make sure that the previous layer is completely dry. If it is not dry, it can smudge your painting and you will not get the results that you desire for. So for this background I have mixed olive green color with black and here I will show you how you can start painting with darker colors and move upward to lighter colors. So I took a little lighter color than the background and started painting some leaves. It started raining outside so I thought it was a good idea to light a candle. While this layer is drying, we will work on the details with the darker shades of the used colors on the flowers and the leaves. This is how you add details to a gouache painting by adding layers on top of layers. So for this painting, at every layer we are taking a lighter shade of the same color and layering the leaves on top of the previous ones. You can see the difference between the colors of the background, the first layer and the second layer. Here I am constantly switching the paintings so that I can give enough time for each layer to dry completely. While working with gouache, you have to make sure that you are confident with every brush stroke because you cannot undo it and uh, you cannot just erase it or smudge it and mix it with the background or anything. You have to paint over it and it may not look as good as the first time. And I'm just filling out some of the empty spaces with flowers and details. You can already see the depth in the painting because we are painting in layers. Here is the lightest shade of the green that I will be using and you can see the difference between the darkest and the lightest color. And this is the last layer of the leaves that we will paint in this painting. And now we will add some white flowers on top of it. You 
can see the consistency of the paints and if it is too watery it will not give this effect and it will not stand out as much So guys these are the final paintings and I really love the colors in these So guys this video was to show you how you can achieve great results and great effects by using layering in gouache I hope you like this video and if you have any questions or doubts you can comment below and I will get back to you as soon as possible So guys if you are just starting out with gouache you can check out this video that I have created as an introduction to gouache and uh, you will get your answers there and if you're new here please subscribe to the channel so guys thank you for watching and see you next time